Good morning and welcome to our Unity Orientation. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about Unity and our Spiritual Center. This video is designed to give you a brief introduction to the history and teachings of the Unity Movement as well as to give you an overview of what we offer here at Unity of Columbia. It is also the first step in a process that will help you to discern if you want to become a voting member at Unity of Columbia. Whether or not you decide to become a voting member of our community, we want you to know that we are a safe and sacred place for you to strengthen your awareness of God within you. Let's begin with a brief overview of Unity's foundational teachings. Unity is a positive, practical, progressive approach to Christianity based on the teachings of Jesus and the power of prayer. Unity honors the universal truths in all religions and respects each individual's right to choose a spiritual path. In unity, we believe that we are each individual expressions of God. Our essential nature is divine, and therefore we are inherently good. Our purpose is to express our divine potential as realized and demonstrated by Jesus and other master teachers. And the more we awaken to our own divine nature, the more fully God is able to express in and through our lives. In our spiritual practice, we are guided by five basic principles. One, God is absolute good, everywhere present. Two, our essence is of God, and therefore we are inherently good. Three, we create our experience by the activity of our thinking. Four, prayer and meditation are the highest forms of creative thinking. And five, when we practice these principles, we live the truth we know. All of the many activities at Unity of Columbia arise in service to our vision, mission, and core values. We are an open, inclusive, and affirming community. We believe that all people are created with sacred worth. We strive to be supportive and affirming of all, regardless of race, color, gender, age, creed, religion, national origin, ethnicity, physical disability, sexual orientation, or gender identity. Our sincere desire is to ensure that unity is non-discriminatory and supports diversity. Reverend Lori Boyd provides spiritual leadership here at Unity of Columbia. In addition to speaking at our Sunday service, she teaches classes and workshops and is available for one-on-one -on -one pastoral counseling. Unity is a nonprofit membership organization governed by a board of trustees. Our board includes the minister and six people elected from and by our voting members. The board provides direction and oversight for financial and policy matters. It is guided by our bylaws and recognized by Unity Worldwide Ministries, our parent organization. Feel free to contact our board anytime at board at unityofcolumbia.org. Our center is supported through the generosity of our membership. We call your financial gifts love offerings, knowing they are a reflection of your love for this community and its vision, mission, and values. We emphasize giving in all three areas of time, talent, and treasure. Your participation and support make this spiritual community possible. In turn, Unity of Columbia supports our parent organizations through our time, talent, and treasure. We currently offer a Sunday service each week at 10 a.m. The core of the service is formed by the message, the meditation, and the music. These elements are intertwined to create a sacred experience, engaging both the heart and the mind. Unity recognizes that there are many expressions of family life. All are welcome. 
Unity creates an affirming environment for our children that fosters positive self-image, personal responsibility, and unconditional love and acceptance. Danielle Hampton is our Youth and Family Ministry Director. She coordinates a team of dedicated volunteers in helping our children explore their inner truth each Sunday morning. While parents attend the service in the sanctuary, kids meet in the YFM wing. We currently offer a nursery in Unitots for preschoolers and Unikids for first through third grade, Unifriends for fourth through fifth grade, and teens for grades six through twelve. Unity offers a number of ministry affiliate groups to support our members. The Women's Ministry is the Association of Female Identifying People who attend Unity of Columbia. The Men's Ministry is the Association of Male Identifying People who attend Unity of Columbia. We also offer an LGBTQ spirit group. These groups provide open and affirming spiritual support in a small group setting. Group members engage in spiritual, social, and service activities together. Small group ministry is a vital part of Unity of Columbia. Groups of 8 to 10 people meet weekly to reflect on and discuss significant life topics. Each series lasts 10 weeks and includes discussion on a spiritual topic, a social activity, and a service project. Unity's Adult Education Ministry provides many opportunities for deepening your spiritual understanding and spiritual practices. Workshops, classes, and retreats are held on a variety of topics in many formats and on various days of the week. Watch for posters, newsletter articles, and Sunday morning announcements for the times and topics. You can also explore the online classes offered by Unity Worldwide Spiritual Institute. Our care ministry team supports our members during life's more challenging moments. They provide elder care, visiting members in nursing homes and helping with transportation to Unity services and events. They support members during illness with hospital and home visits, food and transportation to doctor appointments. And they also support members during end of life transitions, including visits, cards, and help with memorial services. Unity sponsors two grief support groups. A grief support group provides an opportunity to be with other individuals who are dealing with the grief of losing a loved one. Our music director is Audra Sergal. Nominated as one of Inside Columbia's best vocalists, Audra is an active educator, conductor, and composer. She holds a master's degree in vocal music from Central Methodist University. The music in our Sunday services provides the opportunity for local and national musicians to display their talents in vocal and instrumental ensembles. Our choir performs regularly throughout the year. Our bell ringers are a highlight of our Christmas concert. The Solar Gallery provides an opportunity for in-house artists, as well as artists from the community, to share their talents. Past shows have included such media as oils, watercolors, computer graphics, fabric art, and photography. We have an active and energetic outreach ministry team at Unity of Columbia. This team provides monthly opportunities for members of our spiritual family to give the gift of service in our greater Columbia community. They engage in a wide variety of activities including the Food Bank of Central and Northeast Missouri, Clean Up Columbia, Habitat for Humanity, Adopt a Family Christmas Program, and many more. The Knit, Crochet, Give group meets every other week on Friday from 1 to 3 p.m. This group creates a variety of handcrafted items including baby hats, twiddle muffs, scarves, and blankets. Unity is a ministry founded on the power of prayer. Prayer and meditation are key spiritual practices in the Unity Movement and in our ministry here at Unity of Columbia. Our prayer ministry team members provide the prayer foundation for our congregation. They hold in prayer all of the prayer requests received by this ministry. They are available in the prayer chapel after each service on Sunday 
to support members in prayer. They take a leadership role in prayer-related events, such as Unity's World Day of Prayer and our Thanksgiving Eve service. Our prayer chapel provides a quiet place for sacred communion with spirit. It features this stained glass window inspired by the fountains at Unity Village. We have two midweek meditations each Wednesday in the prayer chapel at 12.15 and again at 6 p.m. They include 30 minutes of guided imagery combined with periods of silence. These meditations are open to all and suitable for beginning meditators. Weddings, christenings, memorial services, and more. All are among the ways Unity can support you as you recognize and celebrate the spiritual dimensions of life's passages. A Quiet Corner and a Good Book are always available at our Unity Bookstore, as well as many beautiful gift items. The bookstore is located off the foyer outside the sanctuary. As you continue to explore what Unity has to offer, please know that we are eager to get to know you. We celebrate your uniqueness and affirm that you will help our spiritual community become even more vital and relevant in this world. You can make Unity your spiritual home simply by attending our Sunday services and supporting us with your love offerings. You can also sign up to participate in a spirit group, one or more of our ministry teams, or attend classes and workshops. Be sure to sign up for our e-newsletter to stay informed about events and activities. If you are interested in becoming a voting member of our community, there are three requirements set out in our bylaws. You attend a Unity orientation session like this one today, you attend the Heart of Unity class, which we offer twice a year, and you fill out an application to be a voting member. We celebrate new members with the ceremony of spiritual baptism. The Unity Movement began with co-founders Charles and Myrtle Fillmore in Kansas City, Missouri in 1889. It arose as part of a wave of so-called New Thought denominations such as Christian Science, Centers for Spiritual Living, and Science of Mind. They were seeking a new approach to Christianity, one that incorporated both the rapid expansion of scientific understanding in the world and the ideas and concepts from Eastern religions, such as Buddhism, that were becoming known in the Western world for the first time. Myrtle Fillmore had dealt with chronic illness all her life and created a scientific approach to prayer as a healing modality. Her passion inspired her husband Charles, who became a prolific author and teacher of Unity's approach to spirituality. The Fillmores began a small study group with other people interested in New Thought. At first, they all attended their own churches on Sunday mornings and met with the study group on Sunday afternoons in someone's home. Eventually, they decided to have their own Sunday morning gatherings. In 1903, the Fillmores incorporated the Unity Society of Practical Christianity. Today there are more than 600 Unity Centers all over the United States. Internationally, Unity has spread to more than 30 countries with 300 ministries around the world. Unity World Headquarters is located at Unity Village, Missouri, a suburb of Kansas City. In 1919, the Fillmores purchased 58 acres in Lee's Summit, initially called the Unity Farm and now known as Unity Village. The village serves as a retreat and conference center. It is the home of the Silent Unity Prayer Ministry, which offers you live one-on-one -on -one prayer support over the telephone 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. The village also serves as the publishing wing of Unity, publishing Unity Magazine, as well as the Daily Word devotional in print and digital format. Unity of Columbia was founded in 1980 as a study group that met at a private home. Within a few years, the group began meeting for services on Sunday morning. We moved into our current home in 1997. Thank you for watching this video. We appreciate the gift of your time. 
and we look forward to getting to know you as you connect more deeply with our spiritual family.